بسم الله الحمد لله السلام عليكم very excited I'm very excited الحمد لله we uh, every week Saturdays at 7:30 on Can TV 36 we're humbly trying to do the dawah trying to clear the many misconceptions people think that Islam is something that represents an Arab right in the desert trying to blow people up. That's a big myth, a misconception. And we're trying to slowly but surely clear up these misconceptions. This brother James, he's seen some of our shows. He's also a martial artist. That's how we met. And my brother, he's been talking to him a little bit about Islam. He's read a little bit. He's watched some of the shows. Alhamdulillah, the guidance comes from Allah. He's given us the ability to do the work. That's the best business to be in. The business, the baraka business. Where Allah not only rewards you in this life, but in the hereafter. And there's nothing better. Not a better feeling when somebody comes to the truth, acknowledging that there's only one God, worshiping Him alone and not His creation. And that's what this brother acknowledged, is acknowledging today. So, I'm going to go ahead and say it in English. This is the testimony of faith. James, you acknowledge that there is no deity, there is no God worthy of worship except the one true God, Allah, and that Muhammad is his slave, servant, and messenger. Do you acknowledge this? Yes. Now, I'm just going to repeat it in Arabic. Repeat after me. Ashhad and la ilaha illallah wa ashhad anna muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluhu. That's it, brother. Now, one second. We get all the takbirs and we get excited. These are all your brothers. Now they're your brothers in faith. They're going to come up, it's going to be an overwhelming experience. They're going to hug you, they're going to introduce themselves. But I want the brothers to not just leave here excited today, and then they forget about this brother. There's another brother here, Chris, he took Shahada over a year ago. I don't see his phone blown up, not blown up literally, but people calling him, checking up on him. There are brothers and sisters who are coming into Islam, and we're forgetting about them. They need to learn how to play, pray going to start to learn how to establish the prayer praying five times a day you're going to pretty soon pay the charity if you got that excess wealth you're going to be fasting during the month of Ramadan and inshallah you're going to be making hajj to Mecca if you're physically and financially able all these things you're going to slowly start to implement now these brothers are going to come up and introduce themselves they're not going to forget about Chris, he's over there, get the blonde hair, blue eyes. I want you brothers to invite these brothers to your house, to get to know them, to support them, and not to forget about them. Welcome to Islam, my brother. Assalamu alaikum. These are your brothers. It's such an exciting moment. All his sins are forgiven. He is. Now, like a newborn baby, sin free, and the creator of the heavens and the earth who is so merciful, takes those bad deeds and turns them into good deeds. Where else can you get this? Now he needs to struggle and strive to obtain the right knowledge to continue, because this is the first step. Now, he's going to establish the prayer five times a day. He's going to fast during the month of Ramadan. Going to pay the charity, and like we told him, do the Hajj. And try to be the best human being that he can be striving for excellence doing the good that the creator of the heavens and the earth has called him to and staying away from all the bad things that he's told him to stay away from this is a simple way of life is the way of life brought by all the messengers of God the submission and the surrender to one God Islam is not a new religion brought by Muhammad it was something that was implemented and taught by all the messengers of God to worship the creator and not his creation see us at the deanshow.com every week we'll see you next time Assalamu alaikum, peace be unto you.